Hey everyone, it's Brian here. So I'm making this video a couple of days later than expected. Um, I managed to do this with my like with my days off, um, but then like by the time I did it, I went to sleep and basically I've had work since. Uh, I've literally just finished work about 20 minutes ago, uh, like 15, 20 minutes ago. I thought I'd record it now in case I forget, and then basically the same cycle. Um, but basically this video is, I have completed the 12 days of challenge, I completed the 12th and final day. Uh, this one, I was talking to a friend a few days, uh, like a day before it was announced, uh, whilst I was in the middle of working like 10 and 11, and I sort of predicted it would be like a Link Frog one because they've had the spelling one. Uh, the way the Link Frog works is you get an achievement and then your next achievement has to start with the last letter of the achievement you just unlocked. Um, so I'll go over what I got um, later, but essentially that's what day 12 was, was the Link Frog Challenge, so I was, it was weird that I sort of predicted it in a way for myself. Um, yeah, this one took me two or three days to do, so I kind of finished on like this 17th slash 18th, I finished this one. Uh, so the achievements I got, um, so I got Hero of Fortune City in Dead Rising 2, so my next one had to be Y. In right to th this is basically where a, there's a few games in here. Um, I got you can't stop me in ride to uh, so I have to get E, um, which was explosive temper in Dev Rising Two. That was for uh, so Hero Fortune City was for saving 50 survivors. You can't stop me was for I think driving 250 kilometers uh, in a bike. Explosive temper is for using every explosive weapon on a zombie. Uh, return in Halo the Master Chief Collection, I believe it's for completing the last level of Halo 3. Uh, I got Nasty in um, Untitled Goose Game for locking the groundskeeper out of the garden. Uh, You're Not Cut in N uh, Madden NHL, not Madden, fucking, <coughs> it's just EA Sports NHL, there's no name attached to it. Um, so hockey, ice hockey. Uh, that's basically for with the be a pro to get into the squad. Um, then I got Time Attack Master uh, in Assetto Corsa, uh, and I got Right Hand Man in Killer Is Dead, which I might pick up again. I played through that a few times uh, during this, and I actually, yo, yeah, I, I started having fun with it again. I had to take a while to get used to the controls, but um, yeah, I feel like I can pick that one up. I like the last achievement I got was in 2016. Um, I, re I remember with Xbox it used to be like every now and then in their weekly sales some game like some full AAA game would be like three ninety nine. so I'd be like yeah I'll pick that up. Like this was like before Games with Gold was the thing if I remember correctly. Or it might have been, I think Games with Gold was around for a while. Um, but I remember I bought Killer is Dead for only a few pounds so it wasn't too bad. Um, Nighthawk in Race the Sun which is like some indie game that I believe is on Games Pass. Um, I managed to have like an achievement in it before um, and then I played that and that's not too bad um, I'm just slowly working on the achievements for it uh, Knights uh, with a K um, in Halo Master Chief Collection I believe is for finding a terminal on one of the missions in Halo 4 uh, Start New in Unraveled 2 for finishing the first level I got War in Halo the Master Chief Collection which I believe is also in Halo 4 for finding a terminal. I think on the very first level there was something like that. And then my last one, uh, which I basically got to 13 without realising, uh, is Reliable Friends in Killer is Dead. Um, this one is going until the end of the month, so basically you can get as many as you want, but I just wanted to get the 12 because I wanted to get back into actually finishing off some games. Uh, like I said, I've been playing Dead Rising 2 a lot lately. I've only got like four or five achievements left to get in that maybe move on to Dev Rising 2 off the record afterwards but again it's very similar to Dev Rising 2 and I don't know if I want to sit through that much of it it'll be probably one of those things where uh, I'll eventually get back into doing it um, Gears 5 recently announced the Hive Bust not a map uh, recently released the Hive Busters DLC so I started the first mission of that I like that they finally get the Hive Busters a story because for ages with Gears 5 I was sort of like who are these people why should I care about them um, and then you're actually getting a reason to now, which is actually quite nice. Uh, so I'm interested to see how that story is. Um, it's nice they've done a campaign DLC compared to 
their operations where it's just extra characters in multiplayer, extra maps on like Horde and Versus and all that stuff. They've actually done something campaign based, like as well as obviously Batista as a skin. But it's nice to see instead of like a cosmetic thing, it's an actual full on DLC campaign. Uh, so I'm going to be playing through that at some point. But yes, that is the 12 days of Christmas all done. Um, I've had a lot of fun going through this. I might do a video that's a review of the 12 days. Um, but yeah, uh, thank you for watching these sets of videos, or just this video, depending on which one you're watching. Um, I do have other videos. I'm going to... I've, like, I'm also doing a Premier League review. I haven't done the past two weeks. Um, I'm going to wait for this weekend to be done and then I'm going to do game weeks 12, 13 and 14 and 1. It's basically because they've had games going from Friday to Tuesday and I think they had Wednesday off and then they did Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, so it's, it's like essentially they play three games in the space of a week. So I didn't want to do a review and then have to do another one two days later and then another one two days later. I thought if they get them out of the way and then... Because after this weekend, they're um, like after this weekend they're off for like a week, and then they're back on like the the weekend afterwards. So I thought I'd wait till then. Um, so I'll do. I I think I'll do the combined one. I'll just go over the results for them. Um, but yeah, uh, yeah. Like I said, thank you for watching this video and any of the other videos prior to it. Um, I probably should have made a playlist for all these, uh, but I think because there was only like 12, that's why I kind of stuck it up. But again, <laughs> I, like, I'm saying it a few times, but it's normally my signature to end the video. Uh, thank you very much for watching this video. I do hope you enjoyed it, and I shall hopefully see you in the next one.